Hello YouTube, it's me again. I just wanted to make a follow-up video to the French drain video with this. And I wanted to show everybody something that typically doesn't get shown in videos showing how to do projects and all that and that's the cleanup after the project's done. Now as I showed in the previous video, you know, I did a lot of dirt work. I done a lot of backfilling. Well, you can only get so much with the bucket on one of those things, and you can get it smoothed down pretty nice. But you're still going to have clumps and clods and all that. And I think I touched on this on the previous video, but I just wanted to do like a little show and tell. And this is the cleanup work after I'm done. When I get done with this, the project will be completely finished. Now, I've got the front section here about half done. So I'll pan over this and show everybody. This is the before with just the, I'm gonna work with the little digger and the bucket. And then this is your after section. After I took the yard rake and just kind of scratch over the surface. You don't have to di dig or anything, but just when you scratch over the surface, you can see this line right here. This is all rocks and I'm gonna, clumps of grass and, and uh, big clods and stuff that you don't want to hit with your lawnmower. But this takes a little time to do, but as you can see, the payoff is a halfway decent yard, even though it's bare of grass at the moment. It's early fall right now, so it's no point in me seeding because Quite frankly, the grass ain't going to do nothing between now and spring. We might have one or two mowings left in the year. But in the spring, I will seed this down. And by midsummer next year, you'll never be able to tell that any of this was like this. So, before I run this video too long, I will get off here and talk to everybody later. <laughs> 